2K Sports welcomes you to the following presentation of the NBA. Oh, say does that star spangle banner yet wave oh, the land Everyone is in their seats here at the Wells Fargo Center as the 76ers look to grab a win here in Philadelphia. This is Kevin Harlan with Clark Kellogg and Greg Anthony. David Aldridge is on our sideline. For the Philadelphia 76ers, they come in off a good outing against the Pistons in Detroit. And just one look at the score tells you all you need to know. They were dominant in just about every area. I tell you what, uh, how efficient they were at scoring the basketball, especially for an away game, that was impressive. Well, I think the key was the determination and grit and toughness they played with. You've got to be focused to do that, and they were. We are nearly ready for the tip-off, but first, let's hear from our very own David Aldridge. D.A., it's all yours. Hey, Kevin, Sixers coach Brett Brown says that Philadelphia reminds him of his hometown of Boston. He said the city has tremendous pride. The city wants winners. It's a tough, no-nonsense city. Nobody's sugarcoating anything. And I love that because you can just tell it like it is. And my responsibility is to produce a team that plays hard. Guys? Thanks, David. Right on the money. Philly's passion for sports is something that makes them so unique. Clark, how long into a season do you wait until win-loss counts really start to matter? I don't know if you can put a specific timeline on it, Kevin, but I think you kind of look at the season in maybe 10-day windows or five-game windows, maybe a month window. It varies from coach to coach. For me, personally i would try to look at things and let's go guys key matchup i picked them right evaluate from that standpoint so philadelphia will get the first possession here's the starting group for houston anderson is down low with capella the two what y'all think is philly the future are the one in the they got some nice pieces the process the, three spot. the process is no look like it's finally working out on the interior i mean uh, definitely Joel Odeed, if he can stay healthy, will be a great center. I think he'd be good for the center game, too, actually. Get a nice guy that can actually post up, got a nice post game. Oh, oh good one already. I got him. Oh, come on. What? That's on me. I thought he was going to switch out. Oh, I thought I got that. Run the league again. Like back when Shaq did it. Kyle Oh, give me that. Oh, with the block. It's competitive. He's not scared. You know, he's not scared to go at anybody. Oh, come on. Here y'all go with them alleys again. Come on, guy. Oh, clear out, LeBron. Okay. That will be easy today. Capella sets a screen for Harden. A shot by Paul. Nobody around. Yeah. Good. It's Harden. Reddick against Harden. Mm. Foul a chance for another point at the free throw line. That one on MB. James. Understated focus that Harden brings to the table. Despite getting knocked around, his concentration. Putting posters up there. The Let's see if he can get it going. Rebound. Oh! On the second chance points. You know, you look at Johnson. He's in that upper edge. <laughs> <talking about. laughs> so you... All up top. An 11-point game for him in the win against Memphis. Um, oh, yeah. The Good move. Paul's got five points so far. Screen for Harden. Over in the corner, Paul. Good. Oh, yeah. Good shot, Paul. 
eight points. Their stories are similar. Both started playing hoops relatively late. Both are from Africa. Boy, Ryan, your shot is all gracefulness of them beads moves inside. Easy to see the influence of Elijah. I've never seen a player with more control on and off the court. Oh yeah, LeBron James. That's all day. He is a will be in, in two exciting gameplay. Harden. Like that, garbage. Like garbage points, buckets. Getting in the paint, getting nasty. It's now Come on, guys. What is that? Stop with them got dog on lobs. That's three lobs that then went bad. Ah, good one, baby. Right there. That's his assist. All hustle, man. The Pistons in Detroit. Back to Simmons. Right side, Reddick. There's the pick. To the paint. Here's Booker. Terrific mm. design on the pick foot. I don't know how that pass got through. You know, when you let Booker, Kevin, he finishes now. He's a big, burly presence in the paint who handles his business in there. Harden against Simmons. Harden outside. Oh, yeah. It's good from long range. All day. Harden's got the lead up to eight now for the All day, brother. There's a good screen. Oh yeah. Like I say, it's gonna be a lot of a lot of that. Oh yeah, and it come on now. You he got a couple blocks in that game and just an all around great effort. Let's go. Houston's gone two for five from three point land since the end of the first. Bro, what are y'all? That's full. Turnovers off a lot. Just give me that. Just give me that. No lie. Just give me the pass. Oh, look at that screen. Tell you, man, playing like Capella. We playing like Capella. They want to start winning as Booker is screen on LeBron. Covington kicks to Booker. Ah, try to get that. Booker's got eight points. Booker showcasing his deceptive agility as well. Screen by Capella. To the inside. That, and the too easy. And in terms of too easy. And so it's the Houston Rockets in command with a 16-point lead as the buzzer sounds. And if they keep draining the threes like they've been so far, their lead is safe. And now we'll send it over to David Aldridge, who is standing by courtside. David. Kevin, thank you. Here with Brett Brown. Now, Coach, it seemed like you guys came out a little flat. How do you get some energy for the second half? You just got to go with the people that have energy. I feel like we are not the aggressors. We have to do whatever we're going to do through our defense, and so far it's been good. Brett, thanks for your time. Back to you, Kevin. All right, thank you, David. And folks, don't go away. After the break, we'll see you right back here for the start of quarter number three. It's the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Welcome back, everybody. It's the Halftime Show on 2K Sports. Ernie Johnson here with Kenny the Jet Smith and Shaquille O'Neal. Chris Paul has been the story in this one. He had 21 points, two assists, and one rebound. His last game out, he was just not himself. But tonight, he has rounded right back into form with a very solid first half. Kenny, what'd you think about the Rockets? What a brilliant, unselfish half of basketball they just played. Their ball movement was absolutely impeccable. All in all, just beautiful basketball to watch. And over to Shaq, what did you think about Philadelphia? Well, they gave up too many good looks. You look at the field goal percentage against them, this tells the whole story. Not enough activity defensively, not enough disruption, Ernie. Like, Kenny disrupts me all the time, not enough disruption. That'll do it for now. The second half of action coming right up. for Philadelphia. Reddick and Covington make up the uh, perimeter. Look at that boy finally getting something. They finally gave it to me. Sheer power. Left side Anderson. And there's the pass to James. Get some rim on the way. Shot James. Buckets good. That's two. Embiid the screen. 
Here's Simmons. A pick mm. extreme play and finishes the ball. It's oh my god. We'll retain possession here. Here are the top. That's we over five in locks. Stop throwing them. The open man. Outside. Shoots that board. And Houston again with the bucket. And we know just how important a player who can three ball Ryan. Houston needs to get a shot. Give it back. I ain't even called for it. And that's crazy. Presence of mind, hardness constantly. One thing I do give 2K18, you ain't got to call for the ball. All you got to do is make the cut sometimes. Give me that. Set that screen. Oh! Give me that! Love how Capella stays alert on the offensive board, creating second chance opportunities. Thank you. Hey, bro. Floats one. Oh! Come on, 2K. Playing LeBron, though. Screen by Capella. Lob pass to Capella. Out of bounds. Philadelphia takes possession. Yeah, let's check out some numbers here for James Harden. Coming off a terrific season. Come on with the live. Nah. He's got five. No, I didn't, actually. Over Booker. I got you, Bree. They get the rebound. I got you, Bree. Hey, bro. Got to use that IQ. Here in just the second half. Give me that. Oh, oh, foul. Chance to pick up the points at the line. Then check in for Rashawn Holmes. Charge comes in for Booker. Robert Covington. Okay. Check in for Justin Anderson. Oh, dang. And listen, the Sixers were in desperate need of a lead guard, and they got a franchise caliber one. Mm. Good on the three-point shot. Oh, they don't disrespect me like that. When he has the space to fire from deep, he makes the defense pay. And it's Paul penetrating. Gordon. With I didn't know what that was. Bang. Bang. Start of the final quarter of play. Screen by Sharch. Here's MB. Give me it. Come on, bro. That's on Clint Capella. Why every time you block it from behind, it's a foul on 2K? Man, LeBron, where you been at, bro? so competitive. Okay. And one. Fell for it hard. You got like eight points. And you fouled out MB with eight points. And they all know their role and execute it to a T. Down low. And he lays in the One for seven. Congratulations. One for seven. Johnson the screen. Stop sleeping. Here's Fultz. <laughs> nice up and on. Well, I guess a pump and fake. Last season, the Screen by Capella. Here's Paul. That's okay. Seven for 12 now in the game. Four, six or eight points. And he was in my head from the very Give beginning. <laughs> Thankfully, the Pacers won that game. Oh. Uh, game of my rookie. Give me that pass, LeBron. And, you know, Capella. And one. Rebound. I didn't go for the block. Melo. Try to contribute as much as he can on the offense. Melo. And you can. Ball outside. It's deflected. It's stolen by Fultz. One for eight. Oh, give me that steal. Man, what? Hey, bro. On the break. Green. Hey. Continuing to push the act still and build this assist. Yeah, you know, continue. Why y'all ain't like Capella ain't, not, ain't that dude? Simmons. Give me that! Capella's say charge. Charge a screen on LeBron. Boy, you boy, you sends it back. Y'all better stop playing with Capella. Game time. Robert Covington. Luwawu Cabaret. Ball game. And it's and a chance now to send it over to David Aldridge. Standing by courtside. David. Thanks very much with Chris Paul. Chris, a very convincing win, and that doesn't happen often in this league. So what do you take from this? You know, one thing that our, our coaching staff keeps stressing to us every night is that it's about us. You know, so regardless of score, we got to continue to try to get better because uh, we impose our will on the defensive end. The sky's the limit. Well, the focus was there tonight, Chris. Thanks for your time. Back to you, Kevin. All right, David, thank you. And that's going to do it tonight, folks, for our broadcast. For Greg Anthony, Clark Kellogg, and David Aldridge, this is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.
Noble Indy right there, guys. Like the video. Like, subscribe, share this video. More video coming out. And yeah, have a great day. Peace.